Most of the people we spoke with here say they were shocked that Christopher Dorner was even still on the mountain. They had hoped he was long gone. But his shootout with authorities here wreaked havoc all around this resort community, starting with 800 kids who spent a frightening day on lockdown at Big Bear High School. We heard Mr. Gelber, the principal, announce we're under lockdown. This is not a drill. So my teacher, Ms. Barr, um, she, was, she told everybody to get down on the floor, turn the lights off, lock the door. And it was just like straight up panic mode. The students hunkered down and watched events unfold on the internet. It was shocking. I thought he was gone out of Big Bear. And then once uh, he came over the intercom, it was just like, wow, this is surprising. So it hit us pretty big. Worried parents fought the urge to get in their cars and go pick up their kids. I mean, I understand protocol and not race to go get your kid, but very scary still. Nonetheless. You wanted to go race and oh, get it. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes. You hear about this going down in like L.A. and stuff like that, and it's just like, Big Bear, really? This group of teens from the new Vocational Academy, a private school in Pomona, are here on an overnight trip. They hid out in their cabin while Christopher Dorner battled it out with authorities. There's no TV reception at the cabin we're at, so the only way we knew is people kept calling us worried about their children. It was kind of nervous. I'm like, oh my gosh, everybody else is asleep and I'm the only one awake. Oh my gosh, like anything could happen. Fortunately, none of the kids were hurt and all the schools in the Bear Valley Unified School District will be open Wednesday. In Big Bear, Angie Crouch, NBC4 News.